our historical collections and contemporary art. So we have an Egyptian gallery, and we have Renaissance and Baroque art, and we have exhibitions of contemporary art, but the curators and the education team makes the connections either didactically or through um, the exhibitions where um, you show that contemporary artists are not producing in a void. They're always producing looking back at art history and with lots and lots of references. Vanishing Points is the paintings and paint from the Dennis and Deborah Scholl collection. So within their large collection, we've made a selection and what you're seeing here are works that vary a little bit from your traditional way of looking at painting. We have a floor by Jim Landby, we have transfers on the wall, we have some things that look like paintings but they're really sculptures, so it's really stretching a little bit the definition of painting. Well, my wife Deborah and I have been collecting for over 30 years, and in the last decade or so, we've gotten very interested in painting. And in doing so, we've acquired oh, maybe 100 or 150 paintings, but we've never really been able to look at them together. As you look around the room, you can see that the scale of some of the works is very large. There's a 21-foot work by Mark Bradford. There's a 2,000-square-foot work by Jim Lambie. There are three 15-foot paintings by Carla Klein. These are not the kind of things you can put in your living room or your bedroom. So Silvio Cubinas, the director of the Bass Art Museum, was kind enough to ask us if we would create a show from paintings and paint from the collection. Now, when I say paint from the collection, what I really mean is you'll see outside a giant crushed Fiat that has been painted with red, actually pink, Givenchy nail polish. Every woman knows who Givenchy is. You know, this is the fifth time we've done a museum show of the collection. A couple years ago, we did sculpture from the collection at FIU. Uh, before that, we did photography. It's always a joy to come into this unbelievable Isasaki space and fill it with objects that we only get to see in storage sometimes, or maybe one or two at a time. So tonight's a glorious night for us. It's a thrill to be here and to see the works kind of living and breathing with all our friends. It's a great, great fun time for us. Thank you.